Let's Talk. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Talk with Mo. I am your host, Miss Mo. I thank you so much for tuning in and joining me again for another episode. Thank you so much for subscribing in advance. And thank you so much for showing me all of the love that I have been getting uh, so far. I really appreciate the support. Let's get started. This show is going to be about how I feel about getting older, something that I have been experiencing for a while is menopause. (gasps) I have, you know, concerns and, you know, things that I'm feeling and, you know, dealing with about getting older and, you know, going through menopause and and that sort of thing. So, you know, first thing I want to touch on is hot flashes. I've been getting hot flashes for quite some time. They used to just come at night when I'm trying to sleep. That deprives me of a lot of sleep because I get the night sweats and the hot flashes and that's hard. I can't sleep. I do a lot of tossing and turning. And that ain't good. I get sick of it. Needless to say, I walk around sleep deprived a lot of the times. It's no fun. You know, it's bad. So the second thing I want to touch on is me and my daughter, we live together. (laughs) So when the winter months come, you know, it's, it's bad because, you know, I'm walking around hot. You know, like I said, the night, the, the, the flashes used to come just at night, but now they come anytime, all the time, day or night, it doesn't matter. So therefore, I'm running around here hot all the time. You know, you know when the winter, winter months come, you want to make sure that your home is nice and warm and toasty. No, me and my daughter always going back and forth. She's cold. I'm hot. (laughs) It's a tussle. It's it's a battle. So she's saying, I'll turn the heat on. It's cold. Turn that heat off. I'm hot. (laughs) So a lot of times I have to sleep with my window open. Yeah, don't make no sense. But I got to do what I got to do to try to get some relief at some point. So that's something that me and my daughter go through all a, a lot. Uh, moving on to, you know, me getting older. In case you didn't know or, you know, you're not aware, um, I turned 50 this year. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> and so I am so, 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 so happy with turning 50. And just to let you know, there is a video up of me being surprised on my birthday. And so just go check that out after you finish watching this one. Um, it's got my mom in it and I'm with my grandson Jalil. I think it's a you know cute video and I wanted to share that with you all. But getting back on track. So yeah, me getting older, you know, it's fine. You know, what's the saying? Time flies when you're having fun. So yeah, I'm sitting here. I'm 50 years old now. Men and women, they go through different things when they reach a certain age. You know, it's, it's, it tends to be called the midlife crisis. Usually when men go through their midlife crisis, you know, they can do a few different things like get a sports car, get a younger girlfriend, get a younger wife, you know, little things like that. Now, when you're talking about a woman in their midlife crisis, you know, us women, who knows? We do a lot of stuff, you know, but male and female, the one thing that I know that we we have in common is when we reach a certain age, we both think about what have I done so far up to this point? Am I happy? Am I doing what I want to do? Can I be doing something else? Do I like or love what I do? And by that, I mean whatever career that you have, whatever job that you have. Are you happy? Am I happy? Are you doing what you want to do? Are you good at it? Am I doing what I want to do? Am I good at it? Do I love what I do or at least like what I do? So those are a lot of 
the questions that I have been asking myself and I will continue to ask myself and hopefully strive to get the answers and be honest with myself in trying to obtain the answers to these questions that I am asking myself. Because everybody, I think, everybody would like to be doing what they love to do when it comes to their career or their job. Anybody can go out and make a living, but then do you like what you do? Do you love what you do? Do you wake up in the morning or whenever you gotta get up to go do what you need to do? Are you anxious to go? Are you dreading to go? Because you know, all of us have to make a living one way or another. So let's get past that. But knowing that, I'm quite sure that we all would like to uh, make it easy on ourselves the best way we, that you know the best way we can and enjoy doing what we do. That I know that I would. I would like to enjoy and say that I love doing what I do for a career. You need to ask yourself that and don't wait until you get older. You know, if you're young watching this, start thinking about it now. If you know, if you're at a certain age, grown, of course, start thinking about that. Do you love what you do? Do, do, do you, you know, wake up happy going to do what you're doing? If not, you know, think about, you know, trying to go on another path, but think very carefully about what path you want to go on because you know how that could be. You, you might start on one path and that doesn't work for you or it might not turn out the way that you thought it was going to turn out and then you have to try something else. But I heard someone uh, once say, there are no mistakes. There are no mistakes. You're just trying to get to whatever you're trying to get to and whatever happens along the way is just a part of that journey that you are taking, that you are on to get to that point where you would like to be. I hope that I get to that point. I am certainly and absolutely on the road and on an adventure to get to where I want to get to. But that leads me to question of the day. Question of the day is, what are your fears and or concerns about getting older. I would like to hear from you guys with answers to that question. What are your fears and or concerns about getting older? Are you, you know, are you experiencing menopause? Are you experiencing any, you know, thing else as far as health wise, male or female, you know, are you experiencing a midlife crisis? Are you, you know, on the path of trying to, you know, establish what it is that you would really want to be doing instead of what you're doing now, you know? So don't think that, you know, I have all the answers. No, I don't. I'm on this road just like you trying to find whatever it is for me. So, 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 so.